Okay, good morning guys. Today is uh, day two in Hati Aloha Aloha Hotel. So I'm checking out going to Patalon. Um, you see, Aloha Hotel. Last night I filmed during the night time. So today, Aloha Hotel. So this is Hati during the daytime. Okay, so walking. The train is just nearby. It's about two minutes. It's, see, once you come down here, this is Hatiai by day. Train station is right there. And my hotel is right here. So it's about two minutes walk. Aloha Hotel. Uh, it's not that expensive. About $20 uh, a night. The hotel was very, very decent. So let's go to Patalon today. I'm taking the train. I bought the train. Uh, train ticket less less than a dollar for a hundred kilometers so an hour and a half ride for less than a dollar about 75 cents that's the train station right there right in front of me so close to the hotel I chose this hotel because it's uh, very close because I, I was just gonna spend night I was just gonna spend one night in Hatiai so no need to go far away to the outskirts like I did last time so this time I just this hotel is very convenient it's only $20 that's not bad at all Patalon bro bro Patalun or Patalun? Uh, Patalun. 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 Okay. Okay, okay. Patalun. <laughs> Thank you so much, brother. Huh? I'll Patalun. see you. Patalun. Ah. I say Patalon. He say no, no, no. Patalun. Patalun fifty. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So these are Malaysians riders. I saw them at the restaurant this morning. The bikes. The bikers. The bikers are Malaysian riders. When I came early this morning to buy the ticket here, I ate at the restaurants close by and I saw them there. I knew them from their accents, but when I saw, when I look at the bikes, they had uh, Malaysian plates. Okay. Okay, so this is the train station. And this is my friend here. He's walking with me. He's working here. I already got the ticket. I already got the ticket. So, <laughs> oh, I'm sweaty. I'm on the train. There is no aircon in the train again. This is a simple train. Look at this. Buy it and sell it. What is that? Chicken? She's buying some chicken from this lady.
Sorry? Coffee? Coffee. How much? Coffee? Yeah, sip ha ba. 50. 50. Sip ha. Sip 20. Sip, sip, lago ha. Oh. What? <laughs> okay. Oh, she's selling drinks. You can buy anything on the in, uh, on the train. Coffee. I don't know. She told me the price in Thai, but I didn't understand it. No, Patalun. Patalun. Oh, you also? Oh, okay. Good. Oh, mother in Patalun. Okay. 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 Patalun, okay, nice, good, Patalun, yeah. All right, we are moving. We are moving, so there is a little bit of air because there is no air con in this, uh, this train. But all the windows are open, ceiling fans, but it's not working. When the train is not moving, it's a little bit muggy. This, these are like basic trains, old trains. They are not like the nice air con more expensive ones it's also less than a dollar so it's not that it's not you know it's, it's okay you pay 75 cents to travel a hundred kilometers from Hatiai to Patalun uh, for less than a dollar one dollar so you can you can find that anywhere so of course you don't expect the aircon and comfortable chairs and everything um, but it's, it's what counts uh, is the people that you're riding with very friendly they talk they, they you know you're gonna spend a good time talking and hanging out with the people so that's good go, 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 go. you got a mind but even that could change you could flip the gray matter like some batter in your brain uh, that's why to say fake it till you make it a eh? and if you play that game then you just might make a change rearrange all the bad to okay take the worst stuff saying turn them to a game Best I say put them on display on repeat in your brain till you're feeling no more pain. Uh. Never slow yourself down, you can do some more. Push past all the pain and you'll find a door. Open it up and finally explore everything that you thought you could never do before. Uh. And even when you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never answer to no, man, I still go. Go, go. So we are in Patalong. I just arrived to Patalong. It looks, it looks like a nice city from the train. Nice and big. So you can see right there, welcome to Patalong. Okay, all right, so I'm in, uh, I'm in uh, Patalong right now. It took about an hour, one hour, 30, 40 minutes, about that. Uh, 100 kilometers so it was nice all right welcome to the city of Patalon Patalun they call it here they don't like you to misspell the name of the city so I'm just right in front of the train station right here you see the train station and uh, and I'm gonna go and find a hotel you see, nice streets, nice and clean, uh, just like uh, any other uh, small town, with a lot of difference, of course. Let's go find out. Let's go find a hotel. All right, so I just walked, uh, the train station is all the way down there, as you can see, that orange building. So I just walked to this uh, street right here. Yeah, it looks a lot like uh, Hatiai. It's, uh, it's quite a nice city. <coughs> small town Thailand Thailand uh, uh, small uh, Thai uh, towns are very nice and cute there is a charm to it to, to them 
so I don't have a hotel I, usually I just go to the city whatever whatever I want to go and just find a hotel there uh, without booking or anything most of the time okay so we just uh, ordered a hot latte 35 bucks as you, as you see she's, she's making a coffee I haven't had coffee today and teamwork she has a lot of work there how is Patalon? Very nice city? Hello? Patalon. Good? Good? Is it a good city? <laughs> uh, for here. Yeah, thank you. Uh, do, you have, do you have Wi-Fi? You have? Okay, alright. Okay, I'll connect soon. So I can use the... Uh, I can use the Google Translate to ask her because as, as you saw she doesn't she doesn't speak that much English so I'm just gonna connect my phone and find out some, some information about the hotels and stuff very simple uh, coffee shop you see it's quite dark in here but but it's quite nice you know coffee is cheap 35 baht so it's about it's about one dollar it's one dollar one dollar for hot latte so it's, that's cool all right the coffee is quite nice it's a dollar and uh, I mean look at that a cup of coffee I want to I wanna show you this one look at this good coffee is a pleasure good friends are a treasure so that is awesome right there and look at their password their internet password is good coffee ban, ban chao coffee so that's quite nice that's the boss right there it's a very very simple concept coffee shop but i think they have a restaurant there yeah i think they have some food on the other side there oh it's the same thing the, the same thing yeah all right, so well, all right, so it's cool. So the, it's close by the train station. I just stopped here for a cup of coffee. It's almost eleven o'clock in the morning. I have breakfast in Hatay, coffee here. Not even twelve o'clock, so I can go and find a hotel to check in. Most of the hotels here check in at oh, they check in at two. Hmm. Okay, so I have some time. I probably just walk around because the hotels check check in at two and check out at 12. Okay, so I still have about three hours. Uh, well, that will give me a little bit of time to walk around the place and find out and find out what hotel to choose. All right, so I checked in into this hotel, Hofa Hotel, right here. It's an uh, old hotel, it's, it's an old hotel, right here. And I'm thinking to go and find some, okay. So this is the hotel has been here for a while it's not it's not a brand new hotel it's just one of those regular hotels whole far hotel but it's close to the train station and and it's not that expensive uh, it's about uh, ten, ten, ten dollars um, ten US dollars a night so since tomorrow uh, so, since I'm thinking to stay only one night here, I uh, just stay near the train station again. And but I uh, this afternoon I'm just gonna walk around. I'll find something to do in the city. I'm a little bit hungry. If I can have some tom yum, some Thai food, that would be awesome. Okay, so I'm in the food course. Uh, right behind the hotel. The hotel is behind me. I'm on this street. The guy in the hotel, the owner, uh, sent me here. So as you can see, I'm gonna choose something. It's a food court. It's like a, you know where the Thai people eat. So things are cheap. Okay, so I just ordered a tom yum soup from her. A seafood tom yum soup for 60 baht. It's about $1.50 less than two dollars which is awesome and this is what I remember of Thailand a lot of seafood a lot of things are made of seafood but you can see squid and prawns 
they all have prawns, squid, sausages, uh, and, uh, chicken, pork, everything. Whatever you want, they have it. And Tom Yum is very, very famous in Thailand. So if you come to Thailand, you have to try Tom Yum. You have to try seafood, all those seafood dishes. Because that's what Tom Yum is. Uh, and so many, so many, so many, so many other dishes. Not only seafood. Okay, so waiting for the food. Lunch just arrived. I got a hotel room. So she's making me a seafood Tom Yum. A seafood Tom Yum. Tom Yum is a soup. It's uh, spicy and sour uh, soup. Very, very famous in Thailand. It originates from Thailand. So it's, uh, it's, it's good with rice. Okay, my food is here. I got white rice and I got seafood tom yum. So as you can see, it's seafood. It's prawn and squid. Very nice. I love tom yum. And uh, white rice. And I just have ice water because I woke in the morning and I just had coffee so I don't want anything sweet for the rest of the day except water or juices. So the this whole meal is a dollar fifty. It's sixty baht. It's less than two dollars. So it's cheap. To be honest with you, the food is so good. Really, really good. It's pretty spicy. Right there. The soup is amazing. I ordered a fried egg with it. But it's really really good. Alright, so after taking a break after lunch, after lunch. I'm just coming out for a walk to see what's around the, the hotel. It's the Patalon Municipality Market. So I'm just uh, behind the uh, the hospital, the the hotel, right behind the hotel. And this is a public market, but as you can see, it's not that it's not that that busy inside. It's not that busy. It's a bit dark in there. A bit of fish, vegetables. Hello. Oh. There's a lot of seafood in Thailand, so it's quite nice. It's been raining today, so it's nice and cool. It's not that hot. The smells of fish. Look at this. If I had a place to Cook, I'll buy something like that not like this not a turtle buy some fish a fish and then cook it that would be awesome I like markets especially in Southeast Asia markets are always I, I think they, they all look the same and in Southeast Asia they almost have the same products all right so uh, there is a night market that starts in right now in Patalo, let's take a walk and see what what is happening in a night market in Thailand. So, uh, drinks, juices, quite nice corn. I smell corn. Look at that. Oh, no, this one. I smell corn somewhere. I smell corn somewhere. Where is it? Everything in Thai, so you know. Again, you know, good luck with the with the Thai. You know? Oh, it is corn. Hello, corn. That's why. The lunch that I had today was really good. It was a tom yum, and it was uh, it was amazing. I really really liked it uh, for like two dollars, less than two dollars. So I'll probably go back there. The reason why I came here is to see if they have any any nice food that I can try. Street food. But, uh, but you know, Patalon is not a big town, it's not a big... Uh, so it has its own markets and this is one of them. Uh, somebody told me that this one is famous, it's quite near, uh, next to the train station. So let's, talk, uh, let's, uh, let's see what we can... If I find anything good, I'll eat, it, I'll eat here. Otherwise, I'll probably go back to the same place and have the really, really good food. There's some fried stuff. I can't, I can't tell you what it is, but it's 50 baht about a dollar something a dish less than a dollar fifty a dish some vegetables got some meat here hello what is this huh 
Pork. Leg pork. Leg, yeah, pork leg. Okay. So you make soups? Oh, there is some uh, shrimp, fried shrimp. Okay. There is fried chicken here, but it's not as much as in hot guy. See fried chicken. Oh, there is some rice with chicken, as you can see. Rice. And then she has uh, some chicken over there. Rice and chicken. This should be like 50 or 60 baht. He always starts the. He always starts with 50 baht. See the chicken here. You see the chicken pot right here, and the rice pot right over there. This one, what drinks? Ah, huh? tea. No, strawberry. Strawberry. yogurt. Strawberry yogurt. Oh, okay. How much? Mm. One cup. How much? Thirty-five. Thirty-five. Yes. Oh, fresh strawberry or no fresh? No. Smoothie. Oh, the smoothie. Oh, is it? J oh, I see. I see. I see. I see. Okay. 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 It's ice cream. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Oh, it's ice cream. It's ice cream. Uh, it's a smoothie. It's a smoothie. I thought it was a drink, like uh, like strawberries with milk or anything like that. But... I just walked a little bit further away from the uh, from the night market because it wasn't that crowded. I saw this river. I mean, there's some nice houses there, and there is a river. And then I saw this restaurant, so I'm probably gonna look at the menu for a little bit. Let's see what they have. Let's see if I can have some tom yum and rice and. Chan mineral, that's all I, I can read. Okay. Oh, that looks nice. You have an open open kitchen. Open concept kitchen. Okay. And then tables and stuff. You can sit down here. You can see. Alright, so just let's just look at the menu and see if we can uh, order something. Alright, I was just asking for the menu and they were running away, they were hiding because they don't speak English. They kind of ran away from me. <laughs> Hello. Can I can I see first? I see first, yeah? So I'm asking her for Tom Yum, but I want to know how much because everything is in Thai. You can see everything is in Thai. Oh, I think she's uh, using her phone. Again, the language barrier. You know? One hundred thirty baht. Small, small one. One person. One person. It's a small one. Ninety-five baht. Okay. Okay. So the nobody speaks Thai. Uh, nobody speaks English. Everybody speaks Thai. So I'm trying to. What menu do you want? Oh, okay. All right, she's 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 uh, using Google Translate with me. Okay, let me type something for her. So I just told her I want to eat something with seafood, but something small. And the prices here are a little bit expensive.
their prices are a little bit uh, expensive, but it's like 95 baht for, for a small tom yam. Uh, over there it was like 60, 60 baht. So, I mean, the restaurant is nice, but I know a place where it's a lot cheaper. so I just walked away uh, the food is a little bit ex expensive I mean it's same Tom Yum but she's overcharging me uh, I don't like to pay more than the locals and just this morning I had a, an awesome Tom Yum for like 60 baht it's like less than two dollars this one is almost three dollars I am hungry I probably it's at the same place, the same woman. The same woman. Huh? Okay, she says she's already closed. But this restaurant is open. Right here. I can just order over here. Okay, so as you can see, everything is in Thai. All pro everything is in Thai. You have Tom Yum? Oh, can, I, can I see? Oh, okay. Yeah, so I ordered fried rice, Thai fried rice, and I ordered an iced tea with lemon. So one, uh, the fried rice is 60 baht, and the uh, iced tea with lemon is 20 baht, so 80 baht total. So basically it's two dollars, maybe less than two dollars fifty cents okay so this is the food the Thai fried rice so let's eat I'm uh, very hungry let's have an early dinner